what's up welcome to another video today I'm gonna to be talking about the Steam summer sale now if you game on PC you use Steam for the majority of your games library I'm sure and you know that the Steam summer sale is the biggest sale of the year that they hold and oh man there are some incredible deals you can get some games at some ridiculously cheap prices and today I'm going to talk about the games that stood out to me, which either had the biggest discounts or were just great games uh, at a great price. So I'm just going to list off a few. Uh, I'm going to go and we're going to check them out. We're going to look at their discount rate. And then I'm just going to scroll through the, the home page a little bit and, and you know give you a glance at what's there and maybe kind of go over their layout and see what else they have to offer that I may or may not have missed I'm not really gonna go over this points shop thing that they have here because I'm gonna be honest I'm sh not really sure how I feel about it it's weird uh, but essentially you spend money you get points you can spend those points on things to spruce up your profile make it more appealing uh, they do have this I mean I guess I'll show this real quick that stood out to me it was really weird uh, they have the Summer Golden Profile, which just completely decks out your profile in gold. I think that's odd, but sure, whatever. If that's your thing, cool, cool. Anyway, I'm going to get back to the main thing here, and that's the games. Those are the most important things, and that's what we're going to be talking about today. I do want to start off by saying you save an additional $5 on a purchase of $30, so if you spend 30 bucks on games or more, uh, you get $5 off. Not sure if that stacks. I haven't tried it. So I'm not sure if you get $10 off at $60. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, let's let's get right into it. And let's talk about the games. Rage 2. Now this is a first person shooter that's gotten a little bit of mixed reviews here and there. Uh, it was done by id Software and Bethesda. Um, so it's got kind of that Doom feel to it a little bit in terms of uh, the first-person shooter mechanics. But it's just zany as all hell. This game is completely insane. It's off the wall, as you can tell by the video that's playing right now. It's just completely crazy. Uh, it's 70% off. It's $17.99. Again, this is another game that's on sale a lot, often on multiple platforms. Very rarely we have to pay $59.99 for this game, but I think it's well worth $17.99. So if you haven't played Rage 2, if you missed out, or if you know you really weren't sure if you wanted to get into it, I think this is a good you know price point for entry, and it's a solid game. So check it out if you haven't. All right, so we've got Assassin's Creed Odyssey on the list next at 67% off. This game is an amazing open world game. It looks great on PC. It's honestly one of the best open world games I've ever played. It's huge. You can pour hundreds of hours into this game at $19.79 for the base game. That's an extremely good value. It's 67% off. I do want to add that each of the editions of this game are all 67% off. So the savings are bigger the higher up you go. If you get the Ultimate Edition, you're paying $39.59 for basically everything Assassin's Creed Odyssey, all the content for $39.59. It's usually $119.99, so that's a huge savings there. I think this is an incredible deal, so if you haven't played Assassin's Creed Odyssey yet, definitely jump on it now. The next one I want to mention here is Grand Theft Auto V. I know we've all played Grand Theft Auto V. We all own it on some platform somewhere probably, but if you don't have it on PC yet, it's 50% off. It's $14.99. We've all loved Grand Theft Auto for a long time. I think the PC version came out in 2015, but the original game came out on like the PS3 in 2013. This game's been around forever, and in my opinion, it'd be great if Rockstar would just make GTA 6 already, but... If you don't have Grand Theft Auto V on PC, the mods are a blast. You can have a ton of fun with the mods on PC. I would recommend getting it just for that at $14.99. It's kind of a steal. 
All right, next one I want to talk about is Doom Eternal. Now, this is one game that really caught my eye because it just recently came out. In fact, I actually missed it when it released. I really didn't I, I didn't play it. I don't remember what came out. Around, I think it was Animal Crossing came out at around the same time, so I was really, really getting into that. So I skipped Doom Eternal. $29.99 at 50% off is a great price for this game. I loved the other Doom uh, remake and... You know, Doom Eternal has incredibly positive reception. Critics loved it. It's got very positive reviews on Steam. So definitely check it out if you haven't. $29.99 is a solid price for this one. Now the last one I wanted to talk about here is Sekiro. Shadows Die Twice. I wanted it. It's not a huge discount. 35% off is great, but this is a game that doesn't go on sale often. Its price doesn't drop often. This game won Game of the Year this year. It's almost always $59.99 on any platform anywhere you go. So $38.99 is a great deal. This is one of those games that the discount isn't steep, but for this specific situation, it is a pretty nice discount, and this game doesn't go on sale often. So if you haven't jumped into Sekiro yet, it's a great game on PC. Check it out. $38.99 is a great price. Anyway, that's all the, those are all the games that I had to talk about here. Of course, there's more. And before I jump off here, I just wanted to jump through on the homepage and just kind of scroll through and see if there's anything we missed or anything that's been added since I made the list. Now, we've got Half-Life Alex. If you're into VR, this is an incredibly cool VR game. I have not played it, but I've seen a lot of really, really positive reception around it. $44.99 is a really good price for that game. Let's continue to scroll down here. Oh yeah, big one. Divinity Original Sin and Divinity Original Sin 2 are 50% off for Divinity Original Sin 2, 65% for the first game. Uh, these are incredible RPGs incredibly deep 22.49 for divinity original sin 2 is a really good price i like how they have the franchises listed so if there's a franchise you're interested in like say far cry for example you can hover over there and you can see the prices uh, of the games that they have on sale for that franchise mass effect mass effect 2 is 4.99 that's a great deal that is a really really good game it's actually one of my favorite games of all time if you haven't played mass effect 2 or, I mean, even if you have played it and you wanted to go through it again, because multiple playthroughs on that game are extremely fun to do. Borderlands 3 at $29.99, that's half off. I believe on the Epic Game Store it is $29.99 all the time, or at least it has been almost every time I've gone to look at purchasing it there. Uh, but if you want it on Steam, which I prefer to have my games on Steam personally, $29.99 is a good price to get it there. Monster Hunter World, good game, 34% off. We got Stardew Valley at $8.99. And that's, uh, that's the end of the list on the home page. So I hope that this list was helpful for you. You have until July 9th at 10 a.m. Pacific time to get your orders in, get whatever games you want. I think that if you don't take advantage of this sale in some way, shape, or form, you're really, really missing out because watching these, <laughs> these games go back up to full price on July 9th is going to be painstakingly difficult if any of these games you wanted uh, were on this list and shoot back up in price and you weren't able to get your hands on them. So anyway, that's all I have for today. Until next time.